Back in March of 87, Dave Hodge was hosting a game between the Habs and Flyers on Hockey Night in Canada. With the game headed to overtime, Hodge wasn't happy when he found out his bosses were cutting away from the live game to show the news. And uh, the Flyers and the Canadians have us in suspense and will remain that way until we can find out somehow who won this game or who's responsible for the way we do things here. Good night for Hockey Night in Canada. Enough was enough for Hodge, who had witnessed CBC cut away from the Briar that same afternoon to cover the federal NDP convention. Hodge's iconic moment came as the closing music swelled. He looked away and lightly tossed his pen, flipping it 360 degrees before it landed on his desk. The small gesture would become a symbol of Hodge's frustration with CBC's decision to cut away from live sports. Two weeks later, Hodge announced that he'd been fired from Hockey Night in Canada. After 16 years of service, Hodge's firing was met with surprise and disappointment from fans and colleagues alike. Hodge's firing ultimately led to an opportunity for a young broadcaster by the name of Ron McLean. And while Dave Hodge's time at Hockey Night in Canada may have been cut short, his commitment to his values and impact on broadcasting will always be remembered. Thanks for tuning in. Please like and subscribe.